What makes Train Rabbit different to a normal gym? Just probably the energy and the people and obviously the trainers. Um, but yeah, no, it's just really good. I just think it's a proper like team effort and everyone really wants each other to get better and do better. Um, and there's just a really nice kind of vibe about it, both with like you guys and the people that come as well. Hello and welcome to Train Babby. And today I'm with one of our success stories, Victoria. Victoria, you've done amazing since joining Train Babby. Thanks, Eddie. How did you hear about Train Babby? Well, there was quite a few people in my work that had been here before, but one of my best friends, Hannah, had joined and lost so much weight and literally looked amazing. And I had a year to do the same, so I decided to join as well. And uh, what were your goals before joining Train Babby? So this year has basically been the year of the wedding for me. I've had about five weddings, a bridesmaid three times, so I wanted to lose a stone and a dress size before um, October this year. I used to go to the gym a lot, but then moved to London with work and just got into a really bad routine of eating really bad, going out all the time, not really making time for any exercise. And then um, moved back up, realised I got into like, yeah, like a really bad um, habit and just needed to change it. In the space of less than a year, I've lost nearly two stone and dropped nearly two dress sizes. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Now I want you to tell us um, how you've done that. Um, just consistency, really, and just kind of getting into a really good routine, really good habit of coming three times a week, six in the morning, and just making time for it um, and prioritising it over going out and getting drunk all the time. Because I used to just do cardio all the time in the gym and then came here and started lifting weights. Have you lifted um, weights before? Yeah? Not really, not like this, no. Um, just because I wouldn't do that in a normal gym. Um, whereas now, yeah, like love doing all the kind of really heavy body weight stuff like bench press, um, squats, deadlifts. Actually, not deadlifts, I hate deadlifts. <laughs> They're the worst ones. What makes Train Babby different to a normal gym? Just probably the energy and the people and obviously the trainers. Um, but yeah, no, it's just really good. I just think it's a proper like team effort and everyone really wants each other to get better and do better. Um, and there's just a really nice kind of vibe about it, both with like you guys and the people that come as well. And not just physically, but how has it improved other areas of your life since you've been here? I just think one, if you're feeling good and you're looking good, it just improves every aspect of your life, from like your work to your personal life to how you feel. Um, and yeah, just as, as a whole, just feels so, so, so much better. And just the point you touched on there about your personal life, you've even managed to ah, get yourself, a, no, get yourself a boyfriend, up. haven't you? No, I'm really not. <laughs> Let's make it official, I'm not, come I'm, on. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. This is not official. <laughs> right. Yeah. I've not, I'm absolutely not. <laughs> so, you know, it does improve all areas of your life, not just your, you know, yeah, your physical does. goals. <laughs> what would you say to somebody who um, is a bit nervous about joining the gym or might be a bit, you know, like maybe the same sort of fears that you had before? Um, what would you say to them to give them maybe a bit of a push to go for the gym? I'd just say it? just come and try it. Um, I think everyone's at different levels and everyone does different things, but you can kind of gauge it to however, like whatever your fitness level is. So, um, yeah, just do it. Shouldn't they say that because I'm at Friday Gas, but. <laughs> 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 Thank you, you've been great. Thanks, Eddie. <laughs>